Dad, how do we get power from the sun? Well, honey, the sun is the greatest example of power that we know. The sun's rays travel millions of miles to get to the Earth, and they still heat up the planet. I know that much. Well, how do we turn it into electricity? Huh. Well, let's ask our neighbor, Mr. Avery, since he works over at a DTE Energy Solar Project. Sarah, that's a good question. Solar is a part of several energy sources known as renewable energy. That means the source is not used up when we get the energy. Things like wind, hydropower, which is from flowing water, and solar. The beauty of renewable energies is that they are a clean energy resource. Are you going to answer my question, Mr. Avery? I got this. Believe it or not, Sarah, solar panels are mostly made from sand. Sand made into silica so that they have a reaction to the sun's rays. We put 13 to 15 of these panels together to make a solar string. And many strings together create a solar array. So what happens when the sunlight hits the sandy panel? The sun's rays hit the panels and cause electrons in the panels to get excited, breaking free of their atoms. Now that reaction and those moving electrons, they produce electricity in the form of direct current that is commonly called DC. Now by placing metal contacts at the top and bottom of the cells, we can draw off the power. So now the power comes to my house? Not yet, Sarah. We need to change the DC into an alternating current, or AC, before we can send it to your house. Now we do that by inverting or changing the direct current into an alternating current, which we then send onto power lines known as the grid. Now there the power will go to substations and through transmission stations that deliver the power where it's needed. Places like your house, for things such as hair dryers, computers, washing machines, and your TV. Don't forget, we send the energy through safety and metering equipment before it can be used. Some of the energy is stored in batteries, and some goes to the massive grid you talked about. You know, a lot of the power goes to industry and business. Mr. Avery's been installing solar arrays at different places all over southeastern Michigan to harness the power of the sun. You know, on a bright sunny day, the sun's rays give off approximately 1,000 watts of energy per square meter of the planet's surface. DTE Energy is working to collect some of that energy for customers who want to power their own businesses, schools, and homes from the sun. I get it. Know your own power. That's right.